Welcome back to the channel. It's so nice to be back. It's been so long. But today's video is going to be a quick one. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can do a voiceover in HitFilm Express without the use of your mobile phone. Just a couple of days ago, I had to make a video where I needed a voiceover. But when I looked around in the HitFilm, uh, I couldn't find any option where I could, I could do voiceover directly in the software. So I looked around for the videos in the YouTube and most of the videos just mentioned that one should record his voice in a mobile phone and transfer the file onto the computer and then go on, use that file as an audio file. And I just wanted to find a faster way to do it where I don't need to use a mobile phone and I found a way. And that's exactly what I'm about to share with you. So let's jump onto my computer and have a look at it. So as you can see, I have the HitFilm Express 15 open. I've already imported a small video clip to the timeline. It does not have an audio attached to it just because it's a time-lapse video, but that does not matter. Now, if I want to add a voiceover to this, there is no option shown here in the HitFilm Express 15. I cannot do it like an iMovie, but I'll show you immediately how you can do this without the use of a mobile phone. For this, you will need QuickTime software from Apple. Uh, if you don't have it, you can easily download it from internet. So let's go on to this. You click on QuickTime, it opens up. You don't need to open any files, so say cancel. Go up to the file section, click, and you will see three options. New movie recording, new audio recording, new screen recording. So you go to new audio recording and this uh, audio recording window opens but it will not start recording till you click on the record button. So let's say I start it now. I have no mics attached to my laptop at the moment. You can have one. For the sake of this video, I'm not attaching any mic. So let's see. Here I'm showing you a panorama from my window. And that's it. That is your video recording already done. Uh, sorry, audio recording already done. I'm showing you a panorama from my window. Right? Audio is done. All you need to do is save it. I'm going to save it on my desktop for the ease of it. panorama and it's saved we can close the quick time and then I'm just going to go to my desktop open a window a desktop where is desktop here panorama file simply drag onto the media panel in the hit film express and it's there you just need to drag it down and finished here is your voiceover when I play this on That's it. You can treat it just like an, an, any other audio file. You can trim it if you don't want the lag in the beginning. For example, this part here. Um, <clears throat> you can trim this down. And drag it to the beginning or to the later part, whichever, wherever you want. You can simply do it straight on the computer. That's the point. Do it straight on the computer. Save it. Drag it to the media panel. Done. That's all is to it. You don't need any mobile phones and transferring of the files here and there. Just for info, I'm using HitFilm Express 15 right now and I've just come to know about the new version which has been released today or just a couple of days ago, HitFilm Express 16, which apparently has a voiceover option as well. I've been waiting for that version for a long time, so I'm really happy. But this technique which I've just shown you can work with any software. I mean, this is just something you do in your computer and drag the file to the software. It's as easy as that. You don't need a mobile phone or a extra recording equipment. You can just do it straight in your computer. I hope you liked it. And if you did, do subscribe, like, share it with your friends. If you have already subscribed, ask your friends to subscribe to my channel. So yeah, please share it with the people you know who might use this information or who might need this information because 
this will work with any other software which does not have this feature of voiceover. Well, for today, that's it. It was a quick and short video. I hope you liked it. Till next time. Bye-bye.